Did you know that you can create multiple songs in Udio with the same voice? It can definitely be done. This unlocks the ability to create entire albums of AI songs with a consistent voice. Let me show you how to do this. I have a song that I had already created, which I'm going to use for this example. Let me play you a little bit of that. Next, you'll want to isolate the voice without the music. To do this, click on the three dots and click on the download button. You'll have this box pop up. If you switch video to stems, this might take a second, but Udio will populate it. We have each component of the song. This is just the vocals isolated. Just simply click this button and we can download it. With the voice downloaded, the next step is to upload the audio file. Click this upload button, select your song, and Udio will prompt you to confirm that you want to do this. Click the checkbox and click confirm if you agree. You want to make sure manual mode is toggled on. For this one, I'm going to want to add an intro because I want the song to start at the beginning. And then when it comes to lyrics, if you wanted to add your own, you could simply click custom and then type in your own lyrics. For this example, though, I'm just going to use auto-generated. And then under advanced features, for you, this might be set to 40% at default. But for clip start, I'm going to set this to zero because, again, I want the clip to start from the beginning. The remaining options I'm going to leave as default, and I'm going to click extend. Let me play you the first one. So this one started off a little bit slow on the intro, but eventually it picked up with that jazzy big band kind of feel like that one. Here's another example. I noticed that it does pick up even on the cadence of the original vocal. So this is something that you have to keep in mind. But you could also use a meta tag in order to change, modulate the voice upward or modulate the voice downward. And I made a video about that outlining on how meta tags work. And then here's another one. In a land where fire meets the sea, there's a place where love's a mystery. She was lava burning bright. He was ice, cool as night. When the sun sets, they find their way. Melting hearts in the twilight sway. So this one, we had a bit of a doubling up on the voice. I do want to point out that it does take a few tries to get a completed song because there was a few generations, as you've probably noticed, where the songs were missing some of the music in the background to go along with the lyrics. So after some tweaking and some patience, you can create songs that have a consistent voice and that generate music as well to create your full AI song album. But what about Suno? The process to upload and create your songs is much more streamlined. You just click this button, you upload your audio, you will define the lyrics, the style of music, and the title, and then you hit create. Without the same kind of robust custom controls that Udio offers, Suno reinterprets the song a bit too much in a different direction. For example, I uploaded the same stem, so I'll play that for you here. And then when I created the song, it created it in a completely different format with a different gender. So here's the completed version. Lights are shining bright. You get the idea. More and more unique use cases continue to be discovered, and I can't wait to see how AI song generators continue to evolve. If you got value out of this video, consider subscribing to my channel so you don't miss out when new content goes live. And if you're looking to learn more about getting creative with AI tools, I have content popping up that you can click on right here.